Alright there guys, welcome to this video. This is a Quantum Gaming Uploads. What I'll be showing you in this video is the Boeing uh, 247D. Uh, this is a vintage plane. It's like a 30s plane, 1930s. I just wanted to show you what she looks like guys. I've shown you a couple of times, but uh, I really like this plane, so I gotta show her as much as possible. She's very cool. Now to start her up guys, you got uh, the you cannot do it without uh, ticking uh, a box here. If you want to do it all manual, it's going to be difficult for you. So what you do is uh, you click on that. It's like a board. Like an old uh, notepad thing. Notepad board. So you can uh, go through all the stuff in here. So all the stuff are going to be in here basically. From beginning to end. So you've got all this stuff like performance limitations. Weight and balance, engine startup procedure, maintenance, all system, radio equipment, and additional information. So what you need to do is go to this page. Now, uh, if you click on these, the mirror they're active. So I just remove them. We don't need the engine malfunctions. We don't need a realistic engine start. You can do it as well, but I keep it off now. And same for the electrical failures so yeah guys i'm gonna leave it at that for now we don't need that and i'm gonna start the plane with a right on d-pad and holding rb and it works perfect you can see she's starting up Now this is the Lufthansa livery, old livery, which is a beautiful, very cool actually. Look at the detail on this plane, guys. I love this plane. I love. I really do. I really do love this plane. I didn't think I would like it because it's got two wheels, but this plane is a very stable, and you can land her perfectly. She's got no issues with the landings at all. I really like to land this plane. Very smooth. I'm gonna show you guys this flight is gonna be 16.23 nautical miles. So let's go. Just uh, go lower a bit so I can see what I'm doing. I couldn't see before. Now this is a very cool plane guys, very cool plane, I really like her. It's very smooth actually. And she sounds incredible guys. I mean look at her, what's not it like? She's fantastic. Feels like uh, I think it was 15 pounds or 60, and I think it's worth that. She's very nice. She may be slow because she's older, but uh, she's fantastic to fly. And the sound is incredible as well. I really like this plane. So hopefully it's gonna come on Xbox. I would love to see this on Xbox as well. And I think you guys are gonna enjoy it. Now it's going to take a while guys for me to go from here to 14 nautical miles, but uh, it's worth it. Because I think she's very cool. And she handles very well guys, very smooth in the air. So you're not going to lose control or things like that. And maneuvering wise she's very nice as well. Left and right, very decent. Yeah, this all the plane guys. They're very, very, very well done. You know, 
of course they're not like modern like the new aircraft but uh, they're done with uh, passion and uh, they're gonna cut corners they had to do them right otherwise you're gonna be stuck with problems you know today it's like more like uh, everything is like to do with electronics back then you had all the dials and things like that you didn't have like much electronics in the in the cockpit apart from the fuses and the batteries and all that and the lights a few lights but apart from that nothing like today and we didn't have a sat nav in here so when you when you had the plane in your hands that's it all you had like that board there that you see on the top that's and you had the compass that would tell you which direction you would go and that's how you find your destination based on the compass and uh, the direction of the map when you start and when you go nothing like today today basically the plane will take you there like the pilot and everything you don't even have to do anything you just put an autopilot and just watch the plane go you can land it of course but it's much easier today than back then back then it was like hard you know where to go imagine flying for this thing for 10 hours straight and I mean with uh, an airliner today or the jets today you could do like 100 times the speed of this probably this time they've changed so much guys compared to what they used to be I think we're evolving too quick when it comes to technology technology has become too fast like in 50 years we've done so much in technology that uh, in the future that's probably gonna be like every 10 years you're gonna be gonna have some drastic technology change that's how fast it's going it's scary when you think of it when the the world will basically be dependent on technology like it is now it will be even worse but that's what can you do guys it is what it is So cool to land this thing, guys. Very cool. You see the wheels coming down. Born. Did you see that, guys? He's warning me because I'm a bit slow. I gotta just give it a bit of a power. You can see the cockpit shaking, guys. Even that is realistic. I really do enjoy landing this plane, even though it's got two wheels. I really do enjoy landing her. It's one of the few planes that I do enjoy landing. This plane. This plane and the Concorde, I do enjoy landing. I want to test myself. It's funny guys, but when I started, I wanted easy landings. Now, I want difficult landings. You see how small she is, guys. See how small she is. Fantastic. I barely felt that. I touched the ground and barely felt it, guys. That's how cool she is. Did 
is super easy to control guys super easy and the landing did you see how cool that was I barely touched the ground it's so smooth if I did this with other two wheel planes I would be all over the place but look at this that tells you a lot about the plane guys tells you a lot about the plane Look at all those buildings over there, guys, in front of you. All those uh, apartments on top of that hill. Super crazy. So, where should we take her, guys? Should we take her here? In this, uh, Kind of a hanger. I'm sure we go at the front. I think we should go at the front. I wish there was an Xbox, guys. I would have loved to buy this on Xbox. This plane. I really would. I like to fly an Xbox. It's just so much easier for me, guys. I love Xbox. You know that. Beautiful sound, guys. Beautiful sound. And this is the back. You can open that door as well. And there's a toilet behind there. But the super cool plane, guys. Super cool. I love Flyner. Always love Flyner. She's fantastic. But yeah, guys. Hopefully you enjoyed this video. Your one and only quantum game uploads. Take care guys. Thank you. Thanks for watching. Bye bye. Thank you.